accurate forecast. Storm Tracker 59. Grab your coats as you get ready to start off your Wednesday. Another chilly morning here across the two Virginias. Welcome back. A meteorologist Mike Slifer. Temperatures fell back into the 20s through the overnight hours, and that means this morning to start off our Wednesday, it's still cold out there. We don't really see things warm up until we get into the later part of the afternoon. And while we aren't dealing with any snow or rain this morning, what we are dealing with is fog. Factor in those temperatures below freezing and freezing fog becomes a concern. We have seen more fog appear on our fog tracker, and I do think that it will be a little more widespread than it was yesterday morning. So give yourself some extra time. We've got some pretty dense fog being reported here in Gent. Take a look at this. A live look right now over I-77 in Gent shows exactly what we're dealing with. Reduced visibility, and again, those temperatures are all below freezing. So it's possible that we'll be dealing with some slick spots this morning, and we also will likely see that fog linger on until about lunchtime. I don't think we get to see major improvements until we get into the afternoon. And even then, we're going to keep things relatively cool today with temperatures stuck in the 30s and we stay socked in with clouds. For your morning commute, about 26 degrees, slick in some spots, cold out there. Get ready to give yourself some extra time on that commute. I think that's the big story for this morning. A cold front is approaching us right now, but without much moisture to work with, we don't really get to see much activity from this front. I do think that we'll see some drizzle, maybe some light snow showers through the mountains, and that's what Predictor is showing for this afternoon as the front itself actually passes through. But as we get into the overnight hours and into your Thursday morning, we start to warm things up quickly. A warm front lifts on over us and now we'll fire off some showers. We see rain start up here tomorrow morning and this rain lasts all the way through the evening hours and into Friday. The low itself then passes by a cold front passes on Friday, allowing for a brief cool down in a brief transition to some upslope snow. And then as we get into Saturday, we watch yet another warm front approach from the south. And that is really when we see those temperatures take a turn for the warmer but it doesn't last too long at all. We're forecasting highs around 47 on Saturday, dropping things down into the teens by Monday. It is going to be cold to start off next week. Temperatures are going to be in the teens during the day, and that means overnight we'll see lows in the single digits and the low teens, forecasting a low of about six degrees overnight Sunday into Monday. As that system exits, we may see a brief transition to snow, and then by the middle and end of next week, temperatures take a turn for the warmer, but we also bring back the chance for more rain. Things are looking unsettled here across the two Virginias. So Casey, get ready for more rain and the chance at a little bit more snow. All right, Mike, thank you. Not looking forward to having to bundle up. Well, meanwhile, Mikey is taking their